Have you ever wondered what you could do with the power of a bicycle? First year students from mechanical engineering at the TU Delft have to compete against each other by building a machine. This year they have to pump up water with a device that works by pedaling a bicycle. The team that manages to reassemble their machine within 10 minutes and then pumps up the water the fastest is the winner. The design had to meet quite a number of requirements. For example, they have to install and fix the whole pump within 10 minutes. And then they have only five minutes to make sure that 130 liters of water will be pumped up. They could think of the principle they wanted to apply for themselves. Most of the teams have applied uh, well-known principles, but of course adjusted them to their specific uh, context and requirements. We are group number 57, we made this pump. We have two pistons, the rotary movement on this side is transferred into an axial movement left and right. It's also a double stroke pump, so it not only pumps in one direction, it actually pumps in both directions, which causes a much higher flow of water. So some of them were surprisingly big or small. And the main surprises were indeed uh, about the sizes of the results that they come up with. The leakage is one of the problems. And the other problem is to get the drive line correct and all the transmissions and uh, driving that's needed for that uh, was quite a challenge for uh, a number of students. Well, of course, you, you, you learn to work as a group. That's the whole point of the project in my uh, perception. We have learned uh, in the process of building this pump how you design such a machine. Also uh, calculations, actual raw theory. So in the end it should be still their decisions and not our decisions. So we can only support them, give them advice or help them with ideas, but they have to decide, they have to calculate, or they have to analyze which direction would be the best. So this process is something that they have to really get into their hands and, and have to learn.